Welcome back to my channel, Mark here. I've got the kids out here are painting my two frame mating nukes up. Got Eli there, he's a painting and I've got Emily a painting. I told them they could do whatever they wanted to with them and paint them, so I put them to work. But anyhow, I, I'm out here uh, working on nuke boxes myself, building five frame nukes. And they wanted to do some painting, so I told them they could do it. But I got, I put them to work. So I'll let you see, see them after they get them done. I will see you here later. They got them painted, about all of them painted up today, and uh, there's still a little bit more we have to do on them, but uh, my son, he painted uh, three in the middle there, and my daughter, she did the two on the ends. And uh, I appreciate their help, and I, I was thankful that I got their help today, but uh, there's just a little bit more to do here with them hopefully that uh, when it gets warmer I can put some bees in there and raise some queens out of these here hives but they got them painted up and uh, we'll uh, see what happens here but I also made some more nukes today and uh, it was a pretty good day to work outside. Kind of cool here today, but uh, they're saying tomorrow it's supposed to be up in the 60s and I think on Monday up to 64. So it's going to be here before you know it. But anyhow, there's the two frame nukes all painted up and hopefully they do all right. If you like these videos, please like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. And... Feel free to share them, whatever you want to do. I hope that everyone's doing well today, and I hope wherever you may be that the good Lord's blessing you and that he's a taking care of you. I will see you on the next one. Here's my five frame nukes that I was making there yesterday, and this will go on the end of the video of my kids' uh, painting my two frame mating nukes but right here's the nukes that uh, I built yesterday and I'm going to use these this year and I made double nucleus nukes it's a double nuke and uh, this is what I'm going to try to be using more this year than my 10 frame hives that I have but uh, this is what they look like, and I made them out of chipboard, but uh, I cut a three-quarter inch opening in the front of them, and I made them like that till I could uh, use my oxalic acid wand to treat these. And I think what I'm going to do here, I'll show you here, and I'm holding this by hand, but... Uh, what I'm going to do where uh, I put my oxalic acid vaporizer in here, I'm going to, I might put me a uh, piece of screen up through the middle on the floor here to keep that up off uh, the bottom of my hive so it don't burn anything. But uh, that's what I'm planning on doing. But right here you can see this is what they look like on the inside and what I think I'm going to do is take my propane torch and I will burn this a little bit on the inside. I do that to all my, my boxes that I make but uh, you can see right there that I'll be able to uh, put one on top of this but uh, this is them, and uh, what I ended up doing, I just uh, made these 
out of uh, three quarter inch chipboard, but uh, this is what they look like. I'm hoping they will work. Uh, eventually, I'm gonna, I might have five uh, 10 frame hives that I'll keep bees in to have a little bit of honey, but I think I'm gonna run the most of my bees out of stuff like this. It's just easier to handle and I can buy me a uh, sheet of this stuff and build these pretty quick and uh, I think that's what I'm going to do. But uh, I can maintain these a lot better and I honestly, this is just my opinion and you can take it for what it's worth. And I'm a new beekeeper and I probably don't know what I'm talking about. but. You can, like I said, you can take it for what it's worth. I think my bees will do better in hives like this, trying to winter them through these, than putting them in 10 frame boxes. And my reasoning on this is that uh, they can be, you can keep them clustered together better in, in these hives like this. And they, they can be clustered together better. But that's just my theory on it. I'm probably wrong. And I, if I was a beekeeper out there, I wouldn't really take, uh, take my advice on this because uh, I, uh, I haven't been doing this this long. But anyhow, right here they are. And uh, what I'll do, I may get the measurements off of them and let you know what my measurements are on these that I I made and uh, I will give it to you because uh, mine are a little bit different than than what the measurement plans were on uh, what I got off the internet but anyhow I hope you like this video and uh, like I said here's my five frame nuke boxes and they're they're double deep so uh, that's what I'm going to be using. I hope you all are having a great day. I know I did. I got to go to church this morning. And I got to go and serve the Lord today. And I'm, I'm glad that I got to do that. But if I hope the good Lord is treating you all well today. And may the good Lord bless you all. And I will see you on the next one. You all have a great day and a great evening.